The frommer stop is a long recoil action, and I want to take a moment to explain that before we go on. It means that the bolt and the barrel are locked together and travel backwards for equal or greater than the full length of the cartridge before they unlock. This is pretty uncommon anymore in firearm designs. See there's a lot going on there, that's 700 frames a second. Let's slow down to 2000. That looks a little better. The gun did go a bit out of frame though, so we'll back off and do it one more time. All right, so as usual, let's slow this down and look at exactly what's going on. We're gonna start with the trigger pull. We have muzzle blast there, bullet has left the barrel. Now we have the bolt and the barrel both recoiling backwards together. That's full travel of the bolt and the barrel. So at this point, the bolt stays open and the barrel starts to move forward. It clears the cartridge there, but hasn't started ejecting yet. Ejection happens when the barrel is fully forward. You can see the muzzle has poked through the front of the frame. That releases the bolt to come forward. It picks up another cartridge out of the magazine and chambers it, and then goes fully into battery. It has a three lug rotating barrel that locks it in place there. This is actually a very comfortable pistol to shoot. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching. If you liked it, go ahead and subscribe.